Hi. This is Gene Bosler. I'm in Houston, Texas. It is April. And I want to briefly show you a, a nice example of why it is good to prune the dead out of a tree. Usually we think in terms of dead branches aloft. This is a dead leader. Okay, so this is a red oak. And this leader is dead. Let me show it to you. He died. It was topped out. And it has some fairly recent creature has been gouging it out. I'm guessing looking for some sort of borers. But uh, this is hypoxylon canker. It's a fairly common saprophytic uh, fungal disease with airborne spores. Fairly ubiquitous in the urban, suburban, rural, everywhere landscape. The uh, fresh canker has black or dark brown powder. This is an older canker. And this is why we make the final cut. So if this had died, and instead of being topped out and crossed one's finger hoping that it would live, and then sure a few suckers did for a few years, right? Instead of doing that, if we had brought it all the way down, I want to point out that the top of the remaining leader is is totally gone too, and there's nothing left but but advent, uh, epicormic sprouts on this tree. So if this had been brought back to a proper final cut. It would have begun to callus over, and this hypoxylon would not have had the ability or chance, I guess, or opportunity, because they are opportunists, to spread all the way down here to within about 8 or 10 inches of the, of the ground. So we would have had a callus over here, and now basically the entire tree should come down. Especially now considering that the other remaining leader is, is totally dead the first... Fifteen to twenty feet of it is totally browned out. So that's why we uh, we arborists are not just blowing smoke when we talk about pruning stuff back and not leaving stubs and getting a proper branch collar cut. This wouldn't really be a branch collar in this case because this is a V crotch. But the reason we recommend this is so that the the, a proper final cut can start to callus over and we don't get this hypoxylon well beyond or at least not as much info at wideworldoftrees.com thank you very much for tuning in please pardon the quality I don't have my good camera today thank you